Some of you guys are saying, Psycho Cruiser, why don't you remove that ugly sissy bar? It's messing up the look of the bike, man. Let's go for a ride. You are watching Psycho Cruiser's all-in-one motorcycle channel. Subscribe today. The CBR is coming along real nice. She's going to be real pretty when I get done with her. Woo! But unfortunately, there's a slight delay because I'm waiting for a part that I need to be able to put the fairings on the bike. And that could take up to three weeks, unfortunately. But when I do, woo, woo, she's going to look sexy, man. Mm, she's already looking good. But uh, we'll have to hold off on that. But anyways, I'm going to answer a lot of you guys' questions that have been asking me. Psycho Cruiser, why don't you get rid of that ugly sissy bar? It's just throwing the look off of this sexy, gorgeous Ducati X Diablo S. S isn't sexy and sweet. And there's three reasons why. First reason is because this bike is so sexy and it draws attention, even from the ladies, that I, at some point I do plan on carrying a passenger on the back of here, a sexy female. And uh, unfortunately... With this particular bike, if you don't have that backrest on there, guys, let me show you here. You see the drop-off point here? <laughs> on the big 240 rear tire. And you know this sexy beast has got tons of torque and horsepower. You crank the throttle on this, guys. You know I got the throttle crank syndrome. You can't take it, man. <laughs> you son of a bitch, stop it. Hey, I'm getting crazy in this bitch, man. I'll tell you. She goes sliding right off of here onto that 240 rear tire. Guys, she's going to have a wedgie that she will never forget. Set her up for a real fucked up day. <laughs> You're going to want that backrest on, guys. And like I said, this is so sexy. You are probably going to be carrying a woman on the back of this bike if she'll get on it. You know, she may not, you know, it may be tough to get on that little tiny seat. You're going to have to find one that don't have uh, a big old Kardashian booty or anything. It ain't going to work. You're going to have to get one with, with a smaller booty. To put on the back of there. <laughs> Unfortunately, no big mamas are going to want to sit on this bike, man. But the other reason is, is that because I bought this bike used and saved $8,000, brand new, this bike is like $25,000. Hi, I'm interested in a Ducati X Diavel. Do you have those on hand? How much are you selling it for? Okay, what could you give me cash out the door on that bike? Uh, out the door on that bike? You're looking at about 27 two. When you buy it used, you don't get the small seat that comes with the bike, or at least I didn't. Uh, because if you take off the backrest, you have to put the smaller seat on. And that's, like I said, guys, look at the drop-off here. I'm telling you, and you're going, you're going to probably carry a passenger, guys, I'm sure. But, uh, and I'm too cheap, you know to buy that small seat you know get that small seat guys it's probably like two three hundred dollars you know anything with ducati on it's gonna be expensive man and like i like the look of it i guess i'm in the minority here but i i think it makes the bike look like a work of art it just i think it just adds to the sexiness to it but hey that, you know at the end of the day all that matters is how the bike looks to you because most people out there don't give a crap most people are not motorcycle enthusiasts like we are guys most people think we're all douchebags and they don't like, they, they could give a crap about our bikes. Beauty is in the eye of the beholder and all that matters to me is that I think the bike is sexy with it and that's all that matters. And anyhow, when you throw a leg over it, it doesn't matter anyhow, it just matters about the riding experience. And with this bike, you get an awesome riding experience. It's got all that power. But I'll tell you guys, this WR250R actually gets more attention than any of my bikes, man. What kind of bike is that? How fast does that go? What's up? What you say? That's sweet. I like that. Oh, thanks, man. What's that? Oh, yeah. <laughs> okay, cool, man. Yeah. Sweet, man. I don't know what it is. It's, I guess the dirt bike appeal. A lot of people love dirt bikes, but I tell you, even the women love this bike, man. But anyways, guys, uh... I got a video coming up on a uh, custom GPS build that I'm doing. I took a mount and I customized it for this bike. And I'm going to be, uh, you know, wiring the bike up here so the bike powers the GPS and my camera that I keep on the bar mount there. 
Uh, and by the way, if you want to get this bar mount, which is really awesome, it works fantastic, I can recommend it. I'll include a link in the description and comment section of this video and also the uh, the GPS bracket, which you can, they have, uh, have it for other bikes as well if you want to get that bracket. But I, I did a custom job on that, so look forward to the future video that I do on that. And uh, and also, I'll probably be getting the custom gas cap on here where you don't have to use a key. So, I'll do a video on all that coming up here. But uh, for those of you guys who want to get my gear, you know, my high-vis camel pants or other camel pants I have, my leather jackets, my high-vis helmet, gloves, heated gloves, all that, I always include links in the description and comment section of my videos. Or you can go to my website at cyclecruiser.com and click on the menu tab, My Gear. And those are current links to all of my gear, guys. And if you want to see more of my videos, click on the menu tab, My Videos, and those are playlist to all of my thousand plus videos uh, and I did that so it make it easier for you to navigate through my videos and check out my other channel book out moto that showcases a van that I customized for cheap that allows me to live in my van with my motorcycle anywhere and has a ton of cool mods and that channel has everything from build videos trip videos uh, anything and everything bug out moto Hey, hit the thumbs up button if you like this video. It really helps me get motivated to make more videos when you hit the thumbs up button. As a courtesy, I included two video playlists, one for new riders, and those are all of the videos I've done over the years that I feel are helpful for new riders, and also my popular videos playlist. Hey, hit the subscribe button. I appreciate it. Take care.